system is protecting you as a woman. They give you the, the, the children and they're off. They maybe give you the monthly support, but they live their life free while you have to do it all yourself. This is basically to help you as a woman, to make them responsible, to make them take responsibility of their children. This is not to take your rights away. It's to give you your life back. As Islam recognizes the duty that a both father and a mother have a duty towards raising a child. And just because they're separate, that does not mean that the child should suffer. What Islam is doing, putting an obligation that just because they're separate, that's fine. You can be separate, but you still have an obligation that towards raising that child. Society has just gotten so used to the mother being responsible for everything. Like the, cause we're so strong that we take on so much responsibility that if we were to, not live with our kids 24 7 we are the ones that should be shamed and looked down <laughs> twice a week that's completely okay yeah. that's that like because my ex only sees them on the weekends for two nights right mm -hmm. that's okay that's the norm but for a mother to only see them on the weekend oh and you see even in the comments even the women are upset like what do you mean the kids go to the father you're so conditioned that yeah. you are solely responsible for these kids and he gets away with a check. Yeah. Proves though that men sometimes need to step it up because if men are maintainers and protectors, they really need to come forth with that role. Exactly. They get off. They get off so easily. So and like when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran, you are protectors and maintainers of, you know, women and your families. He is literally telling you that, right? And if you're not doing that, you will be questioned about it on the day of judgment. Yeah. This is a message to all men in this chat. If you are divorced, if you are seek going to through divorce, please remember that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sees everything. If you're not taking care of your children, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sees that. That is worse than the courts coming after you, man. I have to just read this comment. So what are we going to do if the father has to work? Who is going to take care of, of the kids? Who is asking the mothers? Yes. <laughs> to want to work. Who in the heck is asking the mother? Many mothers have gone to jail. They had nowhere trustworthy to leave their uh, children. So, but if a man were to have done that, they'd be like, "Oh, he's trying to like support his kids, like so, an honor roll, like a medal, like wow, he's taking care of his kids." His kids. So the mothers, no matter how much we do, we're expected to do it. But the father, as little as he does, he gets applause for it. Like, wow, look at him taking care of his kids. It's a man, right? If the court is not coming after you, one day Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will.